Cactus is a member of the plant family Cactacea, a family comprising about 127 genera, with some 1750 known species of the order Caryophyllus. For example, almost all cactus are succulents, meaning they have thickened, fleshy parts adapted to store water. The word cactus derives through Latin, from cactus spines are produced from specialized structures called areoles, a kind of highly reduced branch. Areoles are an identifying feature of cacti. As well as spines, areoles give rise to flowers, which are usually tubular and multipetaled. Many cacti have short growing seasons and long dormancies, and are able to react quickly to any rainfall, helped by an extensive but relatively shallow root system that quickly absorbs any water reaching the ground surface. Cactus stems are often ribbed or fluted with a number of ribs. Many smaller cacti have globe-shaped stems, combining the highest possible volume for water storage with the lowest possible surface area. For water loss from transpiration, the tallest be freestanding cactus is Pachycereus pringley, with a maximum recorded height of 19.2 meters 63 feet. A few species differ significantly in appearance from most of the family, at least superficially. Plants of the genera Lewinbergeria, Rhodocactus and Prescia resemble other trees and shrubs growing around them. They have persistent leaves and when older, bark-covered stems. Cacti have a variety of uses. Many species are used as ornamental plants, others are grown for fodder or forage, and others for food, particularly their fruit. Cochineal is the product of an insect that lives on some cacti. Many succulent plants in both the Old and New World, such as some Euphorbiaceae euphorbias, are also spiny stem succulents and because of this, are sometimes incorrectly referred to as cactus. All cacti have some adaptations to promote efficient water use. Most cacti openshes and cactoids specialize in surviving in hot and dry environments. Iozerophytes. But the first ancestors of modern cacti were already adapted to periods of intermittent drought. A small number of cactus species in the tribes Hyloceria and Ripsilidaea have become adapted to life as climbers or epiphytes, often in tropical forests, where water conservation is less important. The 1,500 to 1,800 species of cacti mostly fall into one of two groups of core cacti, openshes, subfamily Opuntioidea, and cactoids. Subfamily Cactoidea, most members of these two groups, are easily recognizable as cacti, they have fleshy succulent stems that are major organs of photosynthesis. They have absent, small, or transient leaves. They have flowers with ovaries that lie below the sepals and petals, often deeply sunken into a fleshy receptacle the part of the stem from which the flower parts grow. All cacti have areoles highly specialized short shoots with extremely short interno. Cactus flowers are pollinated by insects, birds and bats. None are known to be wind-pollinated and self-pollination. 